Friends, one of my postgraduate classmates at Ravensa University and my client called me and said, Roof, what time are you free? Tomorrow or day after tomorrow? I want to meet with you and discuss some important financial decisions. I replied and asked, anything specific? He replied and said, yes, I am in a big confusion. I have to make some important financial decisions about buying a flat. I told him to come to my office on Saturday at 5.30 p.m. for the discussion. He replied, fine, we will discuss it on Saturday. On Saturday, we met and started discussing buying his flat. He asked me straightforward questions. Should I buy a house now or wait? When is the right time to buy a home? Am I comfortable buying now? Is it too soon for me to buy a house? Do I get home loan approval for my case? Do you think I should wait? We discussed it for two hours and finalized things with many calculations regarding the down payment for the loan, EMIs, tenure of the loan or any problematic situation that may arise in the future. Yes, we have finalized how to proceed. Dear viewers, you might be in the same situation. Whatever your age or income, you might think about the same question when buying a flat or a duplex. Should I buy a house now or wait? In this video, I'll share all the answers to your questions to help you make proper financial decisions. Friends, welcome to my channel Rupakumar Pradhan. In this channel, we help make financial concepts simple for you and help you make intelligent and informed financial decisions. Hi, I am Rupakumar Pradhan, certified financial planner, chartered wealth manager and founder of Smart Mantra Financial Services Private Limited and author of the best-selling book Joyful Retirement, the seven-step strategy for healthy, wealthy and early retirement. For the last 12 years, I have worked with 400 plus clients, helping them achieve financial independence and convert their money worries into happiness, which leads to them happy money zone. I am helping clients achieve financial freedom through investments, insurance, tax, wealth management and retirement planning. Should I buy a house now or wait? Here are pointers to consider. Number 1. Goal Setting Is your goal to become a homeowner? You are watching the right video now. There is something beautiful about home ownership and Indians know that. You know that it is why you decided to buy a house. So how do you purchase that flat or duplex or land? Yes, smart goals for buying a flat or duplex can help. What exactly is a SMART goal? It is a specific way to make a plan for reaching your target. SMART means specific, measurable, achievable, relevant and time bound. I want to buy a 1200 square feet flat of rupees 1 crore near Kit University Bhubaneswar within 3 years. Yes, it is a SMART goal you have set for yourself. Could you ask yourself these questions first? What types of the flat are you looking for? 2 BHK or 3 BHK or a duplex? What is the total square feet area? What is the locality you prefer? What is the total price? Means flat cost plus registration fee plus other fees. When should I buy it? Today? or after 3 years or after 5 years. Number 2. Down Payment Dear viewers, please check your current situation. Do you know whether you have required down payment amount with you or not? If you have, it's okay. If not, don't be excited that other friends are buying a house I will buy. 
Friends, how much down payment do you have to pay? If you buy a flat of rupees 1 crore, then generally 20% to 25% of the cost is required. In this case, do you have rupees 25 lakhs in your bank account? What is great is that it helps you to detect the game if you have a down payment amount. Suppose you have sizable cash for a down payment. In that case, you will be in an advantageous situation and pay a low EMI for the housing loan. You must check particular parameters and you must take many actions. If you are young and 25 years old and earning good money, then start saving for the down payment now. How much down payment do you need to have? So for some people that might be 50%. For some it might be 20%. For some it might be 10%. But a person as young as you is already earning money. You should aim for 25% of the flats rupees 1 crore cost. Yes, your income will go off over the next 3 years. It's good for you and if you are more for the down payment then better for you number three emi equated monthly installments yes emi equated monthly installments for paying the loan amount are you earning enough to pay the EMIs for the entire loan period. Could you check it yourself? What percentage of your income can you afford for the EMI? Your take home pay. So after you pay the taxation, whatever is left of that, 25% should be allocated to that mortgage payment means your EMIs. If that payment looks like 35% or 40%, you don't have enough margin to do other things like invest, save off for a car, have fun and go on vacation. If you are taking rupees 75 lakhs loan amount for 15 years with 8.5% per annum, then EMI will be rupees 75,855. Or if you are increasing the loan period, say 20 years, what would be the EMIs? If you are taking rupees 75 lakhs loan amount for 20 years with 8.5% interest rate per annum, then EMI will be rupees 65,087. In your situation and other responsibilities, could you check whether you can pay EMIs? If you can pay the EMIs, proceed and buy your dream flat or duplex. If not, please don't be excited and buy it. Most young professionals think my friend is purchasing and I will also purchase it without checking his situation. Suppose you are not checking the accurate picture of your current situation, responsibilities and future earnings. In that case, it will only drag you into a difficult position and you will be in a debt trap. You know you will buy something more valuable once you put your blood, sweat and tears into the house. Everybody knows that, but check your situation first. Number 4 Credit Score A credit score is the most crucial thing when banks approve any loans to you. It would help if you started by reviewing the civil credit score report and your credit score whenever you borrow money. The best deals on home loans will be available to you if your credit scores of 700 or 750 and above. If you have shown that you are a low risk borrower with an on-time payment history, you will be in line with the lowest home loan interest rate a lender offers. Please check your civil score before applying for your home loan. If your credit score is above 750, you will get a lower interest rate for the home loan. Number 5. Uncertain times 
अनलाइक द फास्ट फोर पॉइंट द फिफ्थ पॉइंट हाज नो बेसिस वाट सो एवर द कोविड नाइन्टीन पैंडेमिक वॉज वन ऑफ द वर्स टाइम्स फॉर एवरी इंडिया एंड वर्ल्ड वाइड नेवर ट्राई टू टाइम द मार्केट बिकॉज वी डोंट नो वॉट विल हैपन सो यू वुड मच रैदर हैव दिस पीस अंडर यूर कंट्रोल एंड गो when you can afford it are you ready for any uncertain times are you servicing a long tenure home loan could you ask these questions to yourself if yes you need to ensure that the emis are paid regularly it is advisable to keep at least 12 months of emi amount in your bank account to manage any uncertain times like covid 19 job loss etc dear viewers you may not be sure if you can handle the responsibility of a home loan at this stage in your life it is a very valid doubt and should be taken seriously please check yourself on the above five points whether you are financially ready or not then decide remember buying a home via a home loan is a big financial decision in your life that has a current and a future implications take a decision right decision friends we have discussed five points about whether you should buy a house now or wait number 1 goal setting number 2 down payment number 3 EMI number 4 credit score number 5 uncertain times friends if you follow these points and make your decision i assure you will make the right decision dear viewers by watching this video please like this video if you got some insights about whether you should buy a house now or wait which will help you to make the right financial decision please like and share it please watch all future series of videos that will help you dear viewers in the future if you want to learn more about new concepts ways of saving and investing financial planning investment planning insurance planning tax planning retirement planning or various schemes yes if you are going to take your financial knowledge to new heights with this channel please subscribe to my channel please share your views in the comment box if you have any questions or doubts dear viewers don't forget to share this video with your near and dear ones suppose you are a person who wants to be financially independent in life and who wants professional help in that case you make the best use of our services you can send me a whatsapp message on the number shown here on the screen or fill in your data in the link given in the description box don't delay if your intention is to be in the happy money zone send the message now i will share new ideas and concepts with you in the next episode till then stay happy thank you so much for watching this episode with rupakumar pradhan